Are you know if you're getting in there tonight? Uh, you know what, if the team needs me, I'll be in, but uh, just waiting here. Still an exciting day for you? Yeah, this last uh, three or four days has been quite something. It's really uh, been special for me, and it's been uh, a lot of fun. Yeah, walk us through this wave of emotion that you've had from the, the signing to uh, the call-up. Uh, yeah, so I found out uh, on the weekend that it was going to be in the works uh, for my agent, and um, just as the weekend went on, played some games, and um, obviously there was a few injuries up here, and then uh, the deal ended up getting done, and... Um, Within like 24 hours, I'd found out that I was going to come up. So it was a wave of wave of emotions all throughout it, and it's uh, it's been really special so far. It's a dream come true. When uh, when the coach told me yesterday, it was start laughing, you know, because it's uh, uh, you start remember when when you went through all all of this when you were young, and uh, now you can you have a chance to play your first NHL game. So it's uh, it's an amazing moment. How much will the the preseason help you? You had a very good preseason. You seemed very confident with your with your game in preseason. Yeah, for sure it helped me that three games I get, uh, you know, you get a little, a little confidence and uh, you just, it's not, for sure it's not the same pace like an uh, NHL game, but uh, so a little closer you play against those guys and uh, especially the AHL games helped me a lot to, uh, you know, it's similar game, so uh, see how strong and fast is it, so it's, uh, it's awesome. I think that's just fun as a player uh, when you have a lot of eyes and your, your role is, is bigger and bigger. Uh, I think it's a challenge, and uh, I think that's uh, that's what we play for, uh, and that's why we're we're all here. We're all competitors, and uh, we try to come here and then do our best every day. And obviously, when we have a uh, more ice, uh, because we have one less forward, obviously it's it's good for us. Did you ever lose hope that you would about the NHL? <laughs> you know what? There's uh, it's a lot of ups and a lot of downs. Um, obviously, the journey that I kind of got to get here has been uh, it's been hard, a lot of hard work, and. Uh, you know, there are some times where you're doubting yourself, but um, you know, getting up here has uh, made it that much more special. So, really glad it's happened. Did you ever feel like quitting? Uh, no, not necessarily. I mean, uh, there's some times where you're like, uh, you're, like, you know, I could be doing other things, but uh, you know what? I love playing hockey. I love this game, and uh, it kind of paid off. So, really glad. Personality-wise, do you get nervous? Will you be? Uh, uh, do you know if you're playing tonight for sure? Or is uh, I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Well, if they call me up, I'm, I'm will, ready to play. Will you get a nap in, or will you be able to sleep? Uh, your uh, routine change uh, a little bit. I never nap before a game, okay. so uh, so no. But uh, if you see me trying to fall asleep yesterday, <laughs> not, <laughs> not good. Not good. No, not good. <laughs> Anybody's career being undrafted just to try and watch what they've done to get here. Yeah. You know what, uh, you always, you know, those stories that you hear are, are special, especially when you're going through yourself. Uh, one of my close friends, Ryan Garbett, um, he kind of went through the same thing, coming out of college, undrafted, and uh, worked his way up, and, you know, he's been a close friend of mine, and just all throughout it, just kind of seeing that he was able to make it happen, and, uh, you know, it's just uh, really special and um, really happy. And he texted you? Yeah, he's in uh, Russia right now, so he found out a little bit later, but uh, it's been good. It's been awesome. When you're not drafted, do you, what, what's going through your mind at that time? I mean, it's difficult. I mean, you see guys that are getting drafted, and obviously that's that's what you want to do. I mean, you want to be the guy that getting drafted. You want to be the guy going through it all. But um, you know what? There's uh, not much you can do sometimes, and you just got to you know put your head down and you know work extra hard. Uh, those guys that are getting drafted are working hard, and you just got to work harder. What are you expecting from the Philadelphia tonight? Oh, they're a good, good hard-working team. Uh, they've made some changes too, and uh, I think they're 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 pushing. Uh, to, to win a lot of games and uh, they're going to come here and then try to take the two points from us. Uh, they're nowhere banged up, but obviously uh, that's that's not our mindset. We want to go out there and, and win a, in front of our fans. Home stand hasn't been as successful as perhaps you had hoped. Is there a mindset change going into this, the, the fifth game of this five-gamer? Yeah, obviously we try to bring, uh, like we said, the, the, the road game at home and uh, try to try to play uh, in our system as much as we can and uh, I think that's going to be our main focus. I was in our meeting this morning, let's go out there and play a full 60 uh, in our system and uh, just trust it. I mean that's what uh, gave us uh, the win on the road so we just got to do it at home now.